And welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Quest Builders. Alright, so we need to go take back the Banner of Hope. Uh, before I do anything though, I'm taking this with me. I need to bring that to where we're going to be start building our base soon. But yeah, we need to go take back the Banner of Hope. They have it in a fortress south of where the castle used to be. Unfortunately, we are not even remotely equipped to do this. If I went right now, I would probably die immediately. I have no armor, no health, no real weaponry. We need to do some prep work before we do this. Fortunately, we have all the stuff that we need to prep for this in this area. Alright, so the first thing I want to- Oh, Oh, I would love to bring a giant ton of wrecking balls and just completely destroy this fortress. Man, if only I had it, like, anything I needed for that. Oh well. So yeah, we need some better equipment before we can do anything here. So the first thing I want to actually build is a furnace. Unfortunately, I don't have the materials for it. We're going to need to find that. Uh, let's see, what else do we want to build? I want better armor. Actually, no, scratch that. I want armor. Right now, I am naked. I want to make myself a giant mountain as soon as possible so I can start uh, grabbing some materials. And I want to make myself... I don't know if I want a stone sword at the moment, to be honest. Because we can get some better equipment later. You know what, though? For now, let's just go get materials. So yeah, the thing about this area is that you need holy water to gather anything here. Due to the fact that if we don't have holy water, it'll just completely shatter if we try to hit it. Actually, I think we can get these sticks, can't we? Yeah, we can. Alright, I'm just gonna grab these sticks real quick. Oh, I couldn't grab those. Those were dried up. Yeah, we should make use of our holy water. It's not like we have a limited supply of it. Oh, whoops. Oh, did that not trigger? That didn't trigger because I got hit. There we go. Oh, also, before I do this, I should probably also build up my stock of healing items, too. Anyways, what I'm looking for right now is iron. Iron and coal. Unfortunately, since everything is gray, it's kind of hard to find. I think there's some of it right there. Here, let me see. Is this, uh, iron or coal? I don't know. One second. Yeah, this isn't going to purify itself, unfortunately. Well, there's ivy there in case I need cordage. So yeah, the first part of this chapter is pretty much just exploring around looking for materials to craft with. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to get myself a stone sword. Just so I can kill enemies faster. Let's make our way back and craft with what we have. I would also like to make myself another chest soon, just because I'm out of inventory space again. Actually, there's a bunch of stuff I don't need with me. Here. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to stick these over here. Stick these dumbbells here. What else do I not need? Don't really need dirt at the moment. Anyways. Oops. Oh, no, no, I don't need to read this again. We already read this last time. There we go. We're a fast reader, okay? So, yeah, I can make myself a... No, I can't. I need more branches. There we go. All right, now I can make myself a wooden mallet. Well, giant mallet. Same thing. All right, with that, I can start breaking items open and getting some more materials. Uh, what else can I make right now? Not much. Oh, I should, have, I should actually equip it. Here, I'm going to make myself a stone sword next, just so I can have something better to defend myself with. I forget, can we purify the area in here? We can. It's nice and pretty now. I'll have to keep an eye on my holy water stores, though, just in case. Alright, so let's make ourselves a stone sword, so now we can defend ourselves better. Alright, so our next major goal is, like I said, iron and coal. Unfortunately, iron and coal and any materials aren't really found in any of the mounds or mines. They're actually stored in those things. So yeah, basically what the monsters did is that they took all the, like, materials in this area and trapped it in those things. It's 
kind of hilarious, actually. They're literally giant balls of, like, iron and coal and, uh, silver and stuff. Also, all the ropes. The rock hoods like us. Hammer hoods. Whatever. So, yeah. We need to use holy water here. I think in order to actually purify these, though, we need to actually get up to their level. Okay, there we go. So yeah, we can see the coal and the... Is that silver or iron? I think that's iron. We can see it from down here. I'm not really sure how they managed to get the blocks out without breaking them, but they did. So I got myself some iron. Here, you know what? It'd be faster if I just did this. I can just make myself a little mining platform. But yeah, since they're up in these giant orbs here, it's kind of hard to get at them. It's going to take a lot of climbing. Alright, so that's some coal and some iron. Unfortunately, the other things here we can't really get to yet. We won't later, though. Ah, uh, there's more coal on this side, but I can't reach it. I'm just going to get as much as I can without just completely destroying myself. Uh, let me see. Can I reach any more? I can reach a bit more. You know what? I'm gonna come back for it. Let's head back to the ruins of the castle. Oh! I just realized I don't have a place to sleep in this area. I might want to think about making myself a bedroom. Oh wait, no, there is a bedroom right here. A surprisingly nice bedroom, too. Oh, I don't have any building blocks. Yeah, I need more building blocks. I do not want to be caught out here at night. I don't have any clothes or armor. Oh! Ooh, chest. Perfect. So you have a place to sleep now. Uh, let's start sticking some of the stuff we don't need in here. Like this world map. It's a cool item, but we don't need it even remotely. Okay, that's good. Actually, I don't need this iron either. Alright, let's go to sleep. This is a surprisingly nice bed in the middle of nowhere. I might want to also make myself a cook fire. Just because I don't want to have to walk all the way back just to get food. But anyways, now that we have some iron and we have some coal, we just need some stone. To make ourselves a furnace. Fortunately, there's stone everywhere. Still, I'm gonna have to go look for some more iron and some more coal later. But yeah, like I said, they are stored in all those, like, there's an orb right over there, too. They're pretty easy to find, because they're so, like, big and hovery. Alright, that should be enough stone. Let's build ourselves a furnace now. Alright, so with this we can actually start working with metal again. I'll clear out these at some point. Oh, what am I missing? I don't have enough iron or... Wait. I don't have enough iron or coal. Okay, I need to go get more then. But yeah, I would love to make myself... Honestly, an iron broadsword would be fine, but a steel broadsword... Steel broadsword? Steel broadsword would be awesome. Sledgehammer would also be awesome. Iron armor would be amazing at the, the moment. So yeah, right now I'm just going to go out and gather as many materials as I can find. Also, I'm just going to go make a quick ivy run. There's ivy uh, right over there. But yeah, honestly, I should also... Actually, you know what? I think dirt is a lot easier to break. Yeah, I should also be building up my stocks of dirt again, just so I have stuff to build with. In case I need steps or something. And might as well just use my stick for it. Alright, that should be enough dirt. So yeah, I need a couple pieces of ivy to make cord with. Uh, I need to kill some hammer hoods for their fur. Let's see, I need metal. I need lots of metal and coal. 
Man, we have a lot of things we need to grab. Which is okay with me. Honestly, I like this part of the chapter. Just exploring the area, looking for items to craft and make better equipment with. Oops. Whoa, nope. Nope, get back up there. Anyways, I want this ivy so I can make cord out of it. There we go. Alright, let me see if I can find any more of those giant orbs around. Uh, let me see. There's one over there. One over there, and then the one that we... Actually, is that the one we broke open? No, that is the one we broke open already. There's still iron and coal stuck in it. It's just hard to get to. You know what? I'm gonna go for the one over there. Alright, let's just make our way over then. And yeah, I'm just gonna be gathering as many materials as I can find. I would love to make myself a giant coffer soon, too. A giant coffer would be pretty good this early on. Oh, actually, wait. We can't purify these yet, can we? We can't purify those. There we go. So yeah, basically all the materials have that weird skull design on them. They didn't get every single piece out of the ground, but they got most of them. Theoretically, I could just go back to the one that I was working on before. I just need to build my way up to it, though. Hmm. Yeah, unfortunately, the range of our holy water isn't doesn't go up very high. Here, we need to get above this thing, actually. Such an awkward climb. Alright, perfect. So, if we use holy water from up here... They... Oh! Mm, look at all that iron. Oh, get into... Get into my equipment? Get into my inventory. Oh, all of the iron. That being said, we need coal now. Actually, I think the one we broke open earlier had a ton of coal in it. Ooh, ow. Alright, let's head back. Actually, no, before we head back... I need more dirt. Alright, that should be enough. Yeah, let's go check out that old, uh... That old orb that we broke open earlier. There, I think there was more coal there that we didn't get yet. Because we have more than enough iron now. Now all we need is the coal and then the wood, I think. We can get the wood from the trees. I am probably going to want to replant some trees inside the base, too. Well, actually, no. These things don't drop seedlings. Only the really big ones do. There we go. Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to plant this in the base real quick. Just so I'll have, like, a good steady supply of wood. Alright. Let's build our way up to it and see if we can find any more coal. Because, yeah, there's coal on the underside, but it's just so annoying to get to the underside. I w let's try to get above it. That works. Alright, let's see what this is. Please be coal, please be coal. Nope, it's iron. This part's coal, though. Alright, so this should be more than enough for what we need. Actually, I probably want to grab some more coal. Alright, that should be enough. Uh, 15 pieces of coal. Yeah, you know what? That's enough. Let's head back. Time to finally gear up. So I believe I have everything I need to make what I want. Alright, so the first thing I want to do is make a ton of iron ingots. Oh, right, item bag. Uh, I'll fix that in a minute. Alright, then I want to make myself a couple of steel ingots. Here, I'm going to empty my inventory again real quick. I've just kind of claimed this room as mine. No one else is here, so it's mine now. 
Alright, there we go. Alright, so I made myself some steel ingots. I want to make myself... Wait. Oh, I didn't pick it up. That's right. There we go. Alright, so I want to make myself a steel bronze sword, broad sword. Uh, I want to make myself a sledgehammer. I'm going to need to make some more iron ingots. I want to make myself uh, more iron ingots. Alright, so let me see. I need a... Where is it? Full plate. Oh, I don't have finest fur. Well, iron armor should still work. I just need to make some cordage. And I need to make myself some wood. Okay. Oh, no, I don't want... Oh, God. Seriously. Okay, I'm getting rid of this book. There we go. Okay, so I need to make myself wood and cord. Alright. So now I should have what I need. Yeah, here we go. Okay, I'm going to make myself a steel shield. And then I'm going to make myself... I would love this, but I don't have access to finest fur yet. The second I do, though, I am making this. But no, iron armor should be more than enough. Honestly, I might be a bit over-equipped for this, but I don't care. I am not... I did not come all this way to die here. Alright, so I have my shield, I have my armor, I have my sword, I can unequip that. And I have my sledgehammer. We are ready. Except for the fact that it's almost nighttime. Let's, uh... Let's go to bed. Oh, I might want to also... Actually, you know, I have enough healing items. We should be okay. How much... Actually, wait, how many creams do I have? I have five. Uh, just in case. I am going to make myself some medicinal herbs. And some more healing creams. Okay, that should be more than enough. Let's go. So we need to go basically raid the enemy fortress to find our banner again. They said it was to the south of the castle. There's also another uh, orb over there that I could break open, but I'll worry about that later. So we're looking for something that's very fortress-like. That doesn't look fortress-like. There's also a chest there, but... Okay, fine, we'll deal with these. I was gonna come back here later, but... Yeah, our new equipment kinda destroys everything in this area. What do we got here? A rock. 20 rocks. They were guarding a box full of rocks. Okay. Ooh, actually, I'm starting to run low on hunger, too. Alright, let's see if we can find any food while we're on the way there. But yeah, we're looking for a fortress. That, uh... That looks like a fortress over there. Let's go take a look. Anyways, I'm also gonna grab these mushrooms. Can I eat these raw? No, I can't. I have to cook them. Okay. Can I eat these raw? No, I can't. Okay, fine. I'll have to make sure I make a cook fire when I get back so I have food to eat. But yeah, this definitely looks like an enemy fortress. I am here for my banner, old man. I'm assuming you're an old man. Alright, so yeah, we just need to clear out the castle of monsters. There are 11 monsters here. Also, I'm stealing your door. Oh, I'm out of inventory space again. I'm just gonna leave this here for now. Alright, but yeah, we just have to get rid of all the monsters. There are 11 monsters in here. They're kinda tough if you don't have good enough equipment. Actually, yeah, you know what? I'm not even remotely overpowered for this. If I had steel armor, maybe, but... Even with my good equipment, it still takes a while to get all these enemies down. Man, there's so many good items here, but I don't have the inventory space. Are you dead? You're dead. You know what? Once I'm done here, I'm coming back later. I'm coming back, and I am going to take everything that isn't nailed down. Everything. In fact, if I can get myself some Wrecking Balls, I'm just gonna demolish this fortress to the ground and take everything that remains. 
These doors, they're gonna be mine one day. Those torches are gonna be mine. These scares are gonna be mine. These walls are... Actually, no, these walls aren't gonna be mine, unfortunately. These... Whatever these are, they're gonna be mine. These monsters, they're not gonna be mine, they're gonna be dead. I might wanna heal soon. Okay, yeah. Let me see, what else is gonna be mine? These walls can't be mine, unfortunately. Oh, there's another quest monster in there. What is... Oh, hi there! Well, thanks for breaking that open for me. I can't see what's happening because of the camera angle. Where'd he go? There we go. Uh, let's see, what's in here? Is it mine? It's gonna be mine. Yeah, I need to come back here once I empty my inventory, unfortunately. Fortunately, all this stuff will still be here. Plus, fur isn't exactly the rarest thing in the world. Uh, where are the other six monsters I'm missing? Are they up on the roof? There's one in here, apparently. Oh yeah, I think they're on another floor. Uh, we already looked in here, right? Yeah, this is where we fought that night guy. Oh, here are some more monsters. Hi there! Do you guys have anything to eat, by the way? I'm, uh, kind of starving. Ow. Oh, evil eye. Oh, evil eye. Oh, oh. Don't mind me. Just gonna heal up real quick. Yeah, I really wish I had Wrecking Balls. But then again, at what point in this game do I not wish I had Wrecking Balls? Maybe I should have made some more medicinal herbs. Maybe I just shouldn't be getting hit so much. There we go. Alright, three more monsters. Please don't be more knights. Those guys actually are a pain to take down. Uh, are they all upstairs? Also, yeah, I'm about to run out of food. Yep, there goes my food. Blah, blah. Okay, then. That, uh... That's a... Ogre. And we don't really have our car with us this time, so we have to take him on legitimately. While we're slowly taking damage because we are hungry. Okay, yeah, we need to play this super safe. Or, you know, he could just not hit us at all. Where? What is he doing? I don't know what just happened there. I think he's stuck. I'm okay. Actually, is he okay? I don't know, actually. But there we go. Oh, there's a chest over there, too. Oh. Actually, yeah, there's some chests over there. Let's go grab them. Ow. Uh, what do we got here? Healing cream. Oh, I need to eat one of those. Okay, yeah, for some reason, I thought it would be a lot easier in this area with this equipment. Maybe the steel equipment wouldn't... Maybe it would be a good idea to grab some steel equipment. Also, these evil items are going to be mine. Alright, what do we got here? There it is. Alright, let's get this thing down so we can start building. And, uh... Ooh, shoes. Oh! Oh! Hello, falling damage resistance. Oh, right, inventory space. What can I get rid of? Sticks. I can actually get rid of these sticks. There we go. We got our banner of hope now. Let's go get this thing planted, and then I need to find food. Actually, I could just... Oh, no, 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 wait, no, I don't want to die. Never mind. But with the less falling damage, we can just drop down pretty easily. But yeah, I was going to say I could just die and warp back, but then I remembered. That's not our warp point, or that's not our spawn point. I think we would actually be warped back all the way to the beginning of the level. Where we spawned in from. Because, yeah, technically right now we still don't have a home base. Is that a metal slime? That's a metal slime. Uh, what can I drop? Man, what can I get rid of? Honestly... Uh... 
I'm gonna stick that right here for now. I'll come back for it. But I don't want to lose that metal slime, uh... Metal slime materials. Anyways, we're almost back. Not too much further. You know what? The second I get back, I'm sticking that banner in the ground that I'm hanging to bed. I'll worry about cooking in the morning. I'll just sleep through the hunger. Okay, I'm just gonna use the healing frame to keep myself going. But yeah, we're finally back and we have our banner. Let's get this thing planted. And now we have our home base for the chapter. Like, two hours in. Well, more like an hour and a half in. But we finally have a safe place where we can build. So yeah, we actually have two objectives this chapter. We need to rebuild the town like always, but we also need to build the legendary equipment. In order to, uh... Yeah, we need to basically build the ultimate equipment so that someone can kill the Dragon Lord. Someone who isn't us, apparently. Oh, we have our home base now. I'm going to bed. It's been a long day. And I'm still slowly dying. But anyways, I think that's a good place to stop. So, next time on Let's Play Dragon Quest Builders, we're gonna finally start building again. Also now, oh yeah, we get the original, like, castle theme. Anyways, I'm gonna talk to everyone next time. So, till then.